back to my channel and welcome if you are new. I am Sky, and I'm so happy that you're here for this video. We own an online interior decor shop called House and Home and we love to share pieces that make your house feel more like home. And over on YouTube here, I love to share DIYs, decor hauls, decorating ideas, and so much more. Today's video is a decor haul from House and Home. We have a huge haul with so many great pieces. A lot of these are just staple pieces for your home. You can use year round. They're seriously so good and I can't wait to share. Now we do have a huge sale going on right now. I think it's the only sale we have ever run on eDesign. So we offer eDesign services over on our website and basically we get to help you design a space in your home that you are just maybe having a little trouble with, maybe you just don't have any inspiration for. Um, yeah, it's so much fun. We love it so, so, so much. So basically the way that eDesign works is you purchase either a large space or a small space. A large space is like a living room, um, your kitchen, a big like master bedroom, a small space is like a laundry room, maybe a bathroom. And once you've purchased your space, you will get an email that is automatically sent to you and it will prompt you with a few questions. Your budget is included in that. Um, we want to know different color schemes and palettes that you like, some things that you maybe don't like, what design style do you really love, and it just gives us a better feel for what you're looking for. Also on that list of questions is like, what do you need in this space? If it is um, a bedroom, maybe you need to replace your bed and your dressers, maybe you need new light fixtures, um, it could be anything. So it really just helps us get an idea for your space. After that, we will schedule a uh, phone call. This usually takes anywhere from 10 to 30 minutes, depending on how many questions you have. And it just helps us nail down exactly what you're looking for and what you want for your space. And then we have about a month to work on your project and we will get you a floor layout and then a design board. And the design board, is really I feel like what is most helpful and what most people are looking for and it has all of the different pieces of furniture, lighting, hardware, products that you may need for that space. All in one spot, you can visualize it and see it all together and it's ready to go basically and then it's in your hands and you get to do with it what you would like. Now you do get one round of revisions. If you have any um, requests, hey, I'd love to switch out the rug to something a little bit lighter. So you kind of get to help me customize it once we are going through that revision process. Once you have received your design board and your floor layout, you're also going to get a shoppable list of all of the pieces, products, items that we have curated for your space. So if there are any house and home items, you actually get a 15% off discount to use for an entire month when you shop with us at house and home. So it expires one month after you receive your design board and your completed project, um, which is really cool. And then of course, any other pieces, items from wherever it could be, Wayfair, Target, um, anywhere. <laughs> you will have links for those so you can click on those and it'll take you directly to the product and you can shop them. We're offering $100 off of either a small or a large space. Doesn't matter. You pick and there's no limit. So if you want to purchase two spaces, then you get $200 off. Uh, this is such a great deal. I'll be completely honest with you. We probably will not run sales on eDesign more than a couple of times a year. So this is honestly huge. We are so excited to offer this to you all and really would love to partner with you to create a space that you love. You'll just use code design at checkout to redeem the discount. And this sale is good through Sunday night at midnight Eastern time. So make sure that you guys check it out. We're so excited about it. We hope that you'll take advantage of this opportunity. Okay friends, I'm gonna go gather all of the decor that I have either picked from around my house or grabbed from the office and bring it 
right here so I can show you the goods. Okay friends, so we are gonna start with my favorite item in the shop right now and it is this new mug. This is called the relaxation mug over on our website and honestly, it could not be named any better. This mug is so cozy and comfy to hold on to. I love how smooth this mug is. I wish that you could feel it. It has some texture to it, but it is like just such a soft coffee mug. And for someone who drinks coffee and tea pretty much all day long, there isn't a time of day that I don't have it in my hand. Uh, I just really go for comfort and that's important to me. So the reason that we picked this mug is because it is big. It can hold a lot of coffee. As you can tell, I have some coffee with some froth milk in here right now. And then I love having a larger handle. I feel like it's just great to get a nice grip. It feels cozy in your hand. And it does have this little lip detail at the top that um, just helps it to be a comfortable hold for you. This really is just like my favorite piece in the shop at the moment. And I am really enjoying it. So I had to share this one first. I've got a couple of great kitchen and bathroom storage solutions to share with you guys. So this first one is seagrass. This is great to hold utensils, or if you wanna put it in your bathroom, you could roll up some washcloths in here, you could put your toothbrushes in here, your body lotions, um, face wash, whatever you'd like. This is also so great for a patio, a sunroom, a deck, somewhere outside um, to put condiments in. And again, like utensils. I just love this piece. I love seagrass. I love the texture. I love that it has almost a little hue of light green in there. I think that it's just so good for um, spring and summer but also again, it's a functional piece that you can use in your home year round. This piece is so cool. It is a terracotta two compartment tray and it has like a reactive glaze finish on it. It is just shiny, pretty, unique. And I want you to see the detailing on this because each one is going to be a little bit different than the other just due to the material that it's made out of and how it's made. You're going to see little markings on them. This just adds to to the character and I love it. So up at the top here, there is some detailing. You can see just that ridge. I think that's really pretty. This is such a good piece for a bathroom, for a kitchen. I love the idea of putting your kitchen soaps here, maybe a sponge or two, a kitchen brush in here. You could move this on into your bathroom and put your toothbrushes in here, your toothpaste. Um, face wash and things like that. This is such a good piece. I hope that you guys will check this one out. It is newer to the shop and um, it's just so heavy duty. This piece is actually very heavy and uh, just great quality. One that's gonna last and that you're gonna be able to use for many, many years to come. I love this next one. This is a beautiful tray. So this is also a similar material to the terracotta compartment dealio that I just shared. Um, it has has like terracotta on the back and then it has this reactive glaze finish on the front and it has some really pretty detailing. It also has rattan handles. So this one is so great for um, taking out on your patio by the pool, serving up some drinks or um, you can use this as a snack tray, a charcuterie tray. The handles are sturdy, they are functional, they do work. Um, and then whenever you're not actually using it to serve food or drinks, you could have it sitting out with a really pretty plant on top, um, maybe some of your glassware. You can just use it to display some of your other pieces in your home. So this is a really good one. I am so excited about this pillow because one, I'm keeping this one. <laughs> and two, I love green pillows. Honestly, year round, you can't go wrong. It's such a neutral color. And this is a very soft green. So I think this would work well in most spaces. If you have like a covered front porch or a sunroom, um, this would be a really good one to have outside but it's also perfect for indoors I love this shade again I love the striping it's just a good size it's a really big pillow 
and I'm gonna definitely be decorating my home with this one this season. This piece is new to the shop. We've actually only had it on the website for a short time, but I realized that I never shared it in a haul. So here we are today checking out this beautiful cookbook stand. This is wooden and I love it. I love adding touches of wood into our kitchen. I feel like it just really warms it up. Um, this would be really pretty in like a hutch, um, maybe on some open shelving as well. Um, it does have the stand on the back, so it will hold your cookbook nice on your countertops. Um, and then you can set your cookbook in here vertically, or if you want to open it, it does have this nice little ledge here on the front, so it will hold your cookbook open. But I think this is such a great, just neutral staple piece for any kitchen. I've got a handful of footed trays and bowls to share with y'all. We're going to start with this mango wood one. This one is gorgeous. I have one of these personally. I love using these for uh, things like base fillers. You can just put really honestly anything in here. We have some really pretty artichokes in our shop that are of course and those look cute in here um, for spring you could put little eggs in here if you have like little decorative um, balls you could put those in here honestly there are so many options another thing that I have seen with these is putting in some uh, floral foam down at the base of the bowl and then having some really beautiful stems just kind of lightly draping over the edge or if you wanted to fill this with some florals you could do that too but there's so many options it's such a good staple piece oh and of course it can be used as a fruit bowl so this is the perfect piece to have on your kitchen counter just housing some of your fruit i want to have a quick look and show y'all the inside um and just so you can see like some of the variations you're going to get with this don't mind the tag at the bottom um but yeah there's there's different markings um totally normal with all of the wooden pieces that you're going to see in our shop and then we also have this footed little, it's like a bowl, but it's also like a tray. It's kind of like a boat. You could do so many things with this. I think for me, the first thing that comes to mind is using it as like a cracker tray. Um, if you are hosting, I'm thinking like game night, playing cards, having crackers in here, but you could also use this for decorative purposes. It's a nice, deep, rich color, and I really like that. I can really appreciate that about this piece. And then we have this one, which is also one that I have in our home, and I love it so much. This one is a mango wood footed bowl. I love how shallow this one is and I love that it has this kind of stand at the bottom. I think it's so pretty just sitting out on some open shelving. I put this in my hutch before. I've used it as a centerpiece. Um, you can use it if you want to serve some food on here. Again, just like all of these great functional pieces for any season in any home. This is a beautiful rattan hanging basket. I love this so, so, so much. You can easily put some floral foam in here and create a beautiful arrangement. Or if you're like me and creating floral arrangements aren't your strong suit, you could just pop a little potted plant in here real or faux it doesn't matter it would look so cute i love having these types of hanging baskets out um, this time of year it's just so pretty it really like livens up your space as you can see behind me here i have um, another hanging basket that we sell in our shop and i put some of our wheatgrass sprays in there that are also available on our website and i think it just was the perfect like little pop of warmth, texture, character, and color up in that space. I love this sign. This is such a cute like cottage farmhouse sign. It says this is our happy place. It is made out of um, like an enamel or it has the enamel finish on it. So you will notice a little bit of variation with that. In our last home, if you wanna jump back, 
several months uh, to some of my older videos. You can actually see this styled in our kitchen above our kitchen sink. We had a window and this was up above the window and I loved it in there. I thought it was so cute. As I've already mentioned at least once in this video, I am a huge fan of seagrass. I think it's so beautiful. We have these seagrass placemats and they're kind of oversized. I think they're gorgeous. I um, of course obsessed with the color. I love the color. Um, I've got a handful of quite a few here, but I just wanted to show you how they're a little bit more unique than some of the placemats um, that we have sold in our shop before. I love just the whimsical look that these give off with the um, extra fray that you see here on the edges all the way around. I think it's just a little bit unique. I think it's fun. Um, again, if you have like an outdoor eating area, I think these would be so pretty. They just scream like eating outside, having a cookout, barbecue, I don't know, love these so much. I love this mustard table runner. This one is just really delicate and pretty. I love how lightweight it is. I think this would actually be really pretty paired with the seagrass pieces that we offer. Um, I think you can make a really pretty spring tablescape with these. And I wanna share the detailing here on the ends. I love the fray. I think that is just so cute and just a nice little added touch. We also restocked these home books and these are so great. They're canvas books. You can open them up and put whatever you want in there. If you have jewelry or keepsakes, we actually love to have ours in our living room and I put the remotes in here to just hide them and also keep them safe from the kids. Um, but yeah, it's just such a cute one. I love just the uh, rustic look that it gives off and it does also say home on the spine. This platter is probably my favorite platter. No, it definitely is my favorite platter that we have ever carried in the shop. It is so sturdy, so heavy duty. I want you guys to see just how thick this piece is. It is an absolutely gorgeous piece and I use this all the time. Um, right now I've got a really pretty Manglewood cloche that sits on it with our coasters, a little plant, and then the home book. And so it just gives a really cute little centerpiece for our table here. And it works well for us, but it also looks so good up in a hutch if you wanted to layer it with um, some of your dishes. Actually, let me give you guys a quick idea. So I love to layer pieces when I am styling them in my hutch. Um, when I'm styling them on my countertops, on some shelving. So this is a really pretty picture. I think it's out of stock unless it's come in by now, but I'm pretty sure it's still out of stock. We're working on restocking it. But just the idea is to layer with a picture. Maybe you could include a little plant. Um, I also have this beautiful piece that I shared in my last video I found while I was thrifting. I think these would pair really nicely together. So again, I think the theme of today is just multifunctional pieces or versatile pieces that you can use year round and all throughout your house. I've got just a couple more pieces to share. This one was too good not to share. We love making bread in our home and I love this loaf pan. So it is the Ray Dunn Artisan Collection. It's dishwasher safe, microwave safe, and oven safe up to 400 degrees Fahrenheit. It is just a really pretty off-white color, and it's just like clean and crisp. And again, setting it like this, maybe in a hutch or something when you're not using it to store it would be really cute. Speckled batter bowls are a 
must have in our home. We use these when we're making sourdough. We use them really when we're baking anything, when we need to whisk some eggs and whip those up for breakfast. They are great pieces. I love the spout that they have on the edge here. There's actually two. One is more curved and one is a little bit more flat. So they're perfect for baking. I want to give you guys a close up here just so you can see the speckle detail. I think that is just so pretty. I love things like this that just have character to them. They're great functional pieces. They're so pretty. And again, these come as a set of three. So you've got the small size you've got a medium size and then you also have this large one the large one is what I use when I'm baking sourdough it is the perfect size for one loaf so anytime I double I have to use something a little bit larger but this is one that I am using on a weekly basis Alrighty, the last piece to show today is this beautiful wooden rustic tea house how cute is this I'm a tea drinker. If you're a tea drinker, let me know in the comments down below what is your favorite kind of tea. I love to make a London Fog with some decaf Earl Grey. That's one of my favorites, but another one that we keep in our house all the time is this organic throat coat. This one is so good. I don't know if you guys have tried it before. I think I just buy it at Target, um, but it helps so much, especially in the winter if you are having a sore throat. This is my tea house, if you can't tell, it is full of tea. Um, we use it all the time. I've got a ton of Earl Grey, and then I also recently got this one, Honey Lavender Stress Relief, and this has been so tasty. Sometimes I'll throw in um, a little slice of lemon to go with it, or, um, what else do I do? Oh, just a little extra honey. Um, I've also made this kind of like a latte, I'm not sure, not with coffee, so not a latte, but I've put some frothed milk in with this one before and then drizzled honey on top and it was really good. So I'll give you a quick close up. Of course, I have some tea in here, um, but the little roof is brown, so cute. And then it has this opening here on the back if you want to load it up and fill it up there. And then you can just go ahead and pinch your tea bag out right there. Okay, my friends, that is all for today's decor haul. Thank you so much for watching. I would love to have you join my YouTube family. If you haven't already, make sure that you subscribe to our channel and we would so appreciate it if you give this video a thumbs up. Coming up very soon is our office renovation. We have a home office that is pretty much a blank slate right now, and we're doing all sorts of goodness in there. I think we're gonna have an accent wall. Chad's gonna build me a really pretty shelf. We've got some new furniture to share, some thrifted furniture all kinds of goodness and I can't wait to share that process of putting the space together and decorating it. Now don't forget that we are running a huge e-design special right now. It expires Sunday night at midnight Eastern time. Um, it's just such a good one. $100 off of either a large or a small space. If you want to, you can get multiple spaces and you'll get $100 off of each space. Use code DESIGN. We are so thankful for each and every one of you and so appreciate your support. I'll see you guys in the next one and I hope that you have a wonderful day. Mm -hmm.